Lily Reinhardt is never one to shy away from keeping it real with her fans and has just set the record straight when a fan posed a very intriguing question about body image and false expectations, to which she gave a genuinely honest response. What is up you guys, it's Susan Morad here for Clever News and first of all, happy Friday, we officially made it to the end of the week and really what better way to end the week than with a little bit of truth, tough love and honesty. Thanks to Lily Reinhardt who keeps it real and lets her fans know that she is anything but the perfectly sculpted stereotype generally given to celebrities, we now know that not everything on television is exactly what it seems. Thursday, Lily noticed a lengthy question left by a fan on Twitter about body image and how the cast of Riverdale feels about portraying such falsely perfect bodies while playing teenagers. Mind you, the amount of questions and comments Lily gets on the regular probably end up passing by her, but this one seems to have really hit home. In the now deleted tweet, the fan tweeted at Lily and asked what she thought about quote, 25 plus year old portraying teenagers with perfectly chiseled bodies. They also questioned whether the show quote, aimed at teenagers are contributing to unrealistic body expectations and body image issues. Lily obviously saw the questions and came through with a very open response. She immediately opened up about her own experience throughout her time on the show. In a series of tweets, Lily responded back by saying, quote, actually, not everyone on this show is perfectly chiseled. And even I feel intimidated by the physique of my surrounding castmates sometimes when I have to do bra slash underwear scenes. I have felt very insecure due to the expectation that people have for women on TV, what they should look like. Lily went on to add that she's now come to terms with her body and that there's no way you'd ever see her walking on a runway. She added, quote, I have bigger boobs. I have cellulite on my thighs, butt, and my stomach sticks out rather than curves in. She also got real about the fact that this is something that she is still struggling with and that her ongoing battle with depression has caused her to even gain some weight. However, Lily has chosen to take the high road and embrace all that she has to offer in an attempt to empower other women so that they aren't feeling bad for comparing themselves to unrealistic expectations. She said, quote, I did a recent bra and underwear scene and felt it was my obligation to be strong and show confidence in myself looking as I do. And I want other young women to see my body on TV and feel comfortable in the fact that I'm not a size zero and I'm not a perfect hourglass shape. I think my favorite part about this whole thing is that Lily didn't finish the fan or end with her tweets in some sort of clapback. She actually pointed the blame towards the industry and its unrealistic beauty standards and even included the names of some people who represent body positivity. Lily said, quote, this industry struggles with accurate representation of female and male bodies. So I commend the women who have helped our industry take a step in the right and authentic direction. Charlie Howard being my favorite role model. I seriously have to commend Lily for always keeping it so real with her fans. It's no question she's been doing so since she first got her start on Riverdale back in 2017. Lily has been very open about her struggles with mental health and body image and has also helped fans realize that she's also just a normal girl with the very same struggles as everyone else. Back in October, Lily was named as the newest face of CoverGirl and as an advocate for embracing one's individuality, she said in a press release for the brand, quote, I have always been a huge believer in embracing one's uniqueness and finding ways to feel good in your skin. She added, quote, since I was 13, makeup has been an incredible source of confidence for me and a tool that can be used to enhance the natural beauty that exists in all of us. So if you happen to be someone who struggles with body image and accepting yourself, just take it from this queen who opened up about how she copes during the times she gets down on herself. She took to Twitter last May saying, to anyone out there who feels depressed or hopeless, do not give up on yourself. You're all you've got and you deserve the world. And when I'm feeling depressed or sad, I remind myself how far I've come and how I didn't let my depression consume me. Okay, this girl needs to take up TED talking or motivational speaking or something because she really knows how to make us feel so inspired. Like I said earlier, this is literally the perfect way to kick off the weekend because honestly, we could all use a little confidence booster and positivity in our lives. But right now, you guys, I wanna know what you think about Lily keeping it real with her fans always. And also, what are some of the ways you cope when you have downer days? And you know what, the people wanna know, and who knows, you may end up helping somebody else out in the comment section who's having a bad day. Get to talking right here in the comment section below. And after that, make sure you hit that subscribe button right over there and also hit the bell to be notified the second we post a new Clever News update. After that, catch up on all the tea you missed right over here. I'm Susan Morad. Thanks for hanging out with me and I'll see you later. Bye.